fucking finally! See what I'm saying about goddamn conveyance? Holy shit. Um, I had to look it up, and uh, guess what? I looked it up, and they didn't even tell me the answer. I looked it up. I, I got up a guy. I checked, okay, how do you do this? And they just said, okay, when you combine A, B, C, D, and F, you'll have the big key, and you can unlock the final save. Congratulations, you did it. And I was like, okay, but where do you click on the room? And I didn't want to look up a video because I didn't want to risk spoilers. So I just had to come back to this and just click fucking everywhere. Okay, turns out it's that little hole right there. I thought maybe it was the big hole or the thing that said open over there. No, it's that small hole. Does that make some sense? Sure, but why doesn't it just work by clicking the door? Would that be so hard? I don't think it would be hard. Sorry, that just, that really bugs me. Um, how hard, like, th that's a thing that's happened in a, a few different places in this, in this game that I've noticed before. I've mentioned it before. You click on something that should, you know, if you have an item that interacts with another item, and you're clicking on something that's directly connected to it, you should just automatically do that. Why, why give the hassle of, no, no, you have to be exactly on it. Even if you're on the thing that's, that's technically part of it, it's just not the exact part, it doesn't work. That drives me crazy. If I'm clicking on the safe with the key that opens the safe, it should open the fucking safe, okay? I'm in- I, you know what? I will say this. I'm enjoying the puzzles in this game a lot. I think they are really good, really well done, really smart, but the fucking conveyance? Fuck it. It's not good so far. There have been- it's the more I've gone, the more I've been like, this is bad, this is bad. They- they needed to work on that, and they didn't. I don't know. Because you should have been able to click the safe and it should have worked. I've ranted for too long about this, but I don't know. I would spent so long trying to get this fucking door to open. So whatever. Hope we can find clues to why Zero, uh, who Zero is this time. So something awesome has to be inside a huge safe like this. Whatever, I'm pissed. That's, that's annoying as fuck. And yeah, that, that didn't make any sense. Like, oh, kill one I, is probably what that says. It's probably kill one of your allies. Anyways, yeah, it said, um, like, this big-ass key goes in the big-ass safe, but it, we had to make the key really small when we put it in this safe, and yet I thought the key was much bigger than that, so that's why I wanted to put in the big fire hole up there. But no, that fire hole is just completely irrelevant. I don't know. Why is this place called Triangle? Still don't know that, but whatever. Alright, yeah, this was the end. I knew that, but nah. I don't know. I'm not sure how much of that ranting I'm gonna leave in, but it really pissed me off. The conveyance in this game really sucks ass. The puzzles are great. I'll say that. I'm loving the puzzles. I, I can't say that enough, but fuck the conveyance. Uh, what does kill one mean? Maybe it means Eric's gonna die. It must mean we have to kill someone. Oh, we have to. You were the one who found this room. What the? Oh! Is that... No! Junpei? Junpei! This is weird. Is this all- wait, is this supposed to be another time? Wait. Weird! This should have been the timeline where we killed, um, D Team, right? No, we killed C Team. Because in the other timeline, we saw that, which means we must have killed D Team. Did we kill D Team in this timeline as well? That would be weird, because that's the same head. Which means we can potentially go in two different rooms for one room that C-Team goes in? I guess. I thought that might happen, but it just seems like... I don't know, it seems a bit weird. Like, we're doing a bunch of puzzles based off one th thing, and there's no start and end, and... I don't know. Maybe, I guess this does mean they both relate to, um... They, maybe they both relate to that one C-Room. And then a different C room can relate to more than one Q room. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. 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 That makes a lot of sense. Okay. So, I got it. Alright, so in the pathway where he kills Akane, that's the pathway where we wind up in those pods, but in the pathway where he kills himself, we wind up in the library. But why? I don't think there's going to be an explanation for the reason, honestly. 
You see, these are the kind of questions I want answers to, and these are the kind of questions that the game a lot of the time doesn't answer. Um, but uh, I wish there was a why. I wish there was an answer for the question why, but it seems like that's what happens. Like, they'll, they'll give you a how, and they'll give you a what, and they'll give you a when, and they'll give you a where, but sometimes they don't give you a why. No! Did Carlos just... kill himself? I think so. But why? Maybe it had to... Play the other timelines to find out! Yeah! Zero time dilemma! ...to do with Junpei's... body? Now announcing the current casualties. C-Team, Carlos, Junpei. D-Team, Diana, Bye. Uh, that's why they say kill one. Fight, jump, blue, blue red. Yeah, it's so same. Yeah, fight, jump, blue, red, milk. Uh, jump is gonna be jumpy. Uh, fight. I don't know, Carlos maybe. Um, there's the blue and the red again. Uh, I'm not sure what that's all about. Red for fi? I don't know. Milk. What's milk gonna be for? Yeah, whatever. Wait, uh, it mentioned five people, right? Aside from us, Akane's left. But why in the world did D-Team... Uh, actually, I was thinking, well, after Carlos killed Akane, I was wondering what he went off and did, but okay. I thought maybe with how ca crazy Akane was, she might freaking kill herself after that. But nope, seems like she was just content. The execution. Back during the vote at 1330, D-Team was... Well, the reason why isn't the issue. What's important is the reveal of five X-Passes. <laughs> D-Team? D-Team was, well, the reason why isn't important. In other words, we're the ones who, who betrayed in this pathway. Yeah, right? Yeah, we have to be. Because, um, yeah, C-Team was supposed to vote for D-Team. Going to Q-Team was them betraying, which means we had to be the ones who betrayed. Yeah, it's a bit confusing, but yeah. We're the ones who turned on them, and we're the reason their team is dead. Pretty much. In other words... If one more person dies... Yeah. Whoa, what are you doing? You're not doing a standoff? Really? Really? Wow. Wow. They actually just jumped for the weapons. What, were they planning on killing Q? Is Mira also planning on that? Or did, like, Eric go there reflexively and the others follow him? I could see that happening. Um, maybe this will mean we'll get an arrow in, in, in uh, Eric because he joked about it? I don't know. It's funny how there is three weapons, though. But, I mean, if Eric fires that off, we probably all would die. Look, guys, we should stay calm now. Let's just put these weapons down. Put yours down first. But what, what are you saying, Eric? If I put mine down, then you'll... Huh? Look over there! Why, Mira? We're in love... Oh, interesting! She's... Oh, yeah, she's pointing at him. In fact, they're all pointing at each other. I didn't even notice that till then. I did notice that he seemed to be pointing at Mira, but I thought Mira was actually pointing at Q. I didn't notice that uh, Mira was pointing at Eric. Okay. Interesting. If I put mine down, then, then you'll die. But if you put yours down, then you'll die. Then you'll put them, then they'll die. Then they'll be, they'll be. That's a circle jerk. Oh, are we? Um, Eric, this will be hard for you to hear, but I think you might be mistaken about that. You're lying. Then why is a gun pointed at you right now? No, it's not what it looks like, Eric. I love you with all that I am. Sounds like bullshit. Mira. What is there to love about him? Why would you possibly love him? I don't believe you, you lying bitch. You're too good for him. Why are you being such a bitch? <laughs> uh. So you know what you need to do, right? Huh? You don't get it? Uh, um, what do you mean? God, how dumb can you get? Oh, <laughs> yeah, you, you have to realize how dumb he is. What? You want, her to, you want him to die for you? I mean... 
Over Q dying? I guess you don't want to kill a kid. Mira, this isn't you trying to get Eric to kill me, is it? Don't be stupid. I have this gun pointed at him so that I can protect you, of course. Yeah, they're all making the same excuse. I'm protecting you. No, I'm protecting you. No, I'm protecting you. <laughs> if I drop my weapon, then Eric will... Then Eric, how about you putting yours down first? No way. Not happening. If I put this down, you'll definitely kill Mira. There's no way I would. How would I know? What proof do I have that you won't up and fire that thing? They all have a good stance in this. Like, they all have a, a valid point. It's, it's hard. Do I have to make a choice? As Q? So that's why we got so many weapons. Hey, we aren't getting anywhere like this. If just one more person dies, one more person, one more, just one more. Oh, you're going to kill one of them? Am I going to get a choice? Oh, yep, there's that beat sound. I'll kill Eric if anyone, but uh, I don't want to kill anyone. I can kill myself. Who will you kill? Oh, no timer. I can't say no one. Oh, wait, can I say Akane? What happens if I said Akane? Kill Akane. Cannot get towards C. Fuck. No, oh, shit. Oh. Fucking bitch. But I want to kill her. She's my least favorite. Alright. Uh. Kill Zero. I just like seeing what their responses are sometimes. Aww. Kill Gab? Shoot the Shaggy Dog! He is not here! What, so you think it'd be okay to kill him if he was here? I don't think that counts. Um... Uh... Eric, I guess. I'm gonna do that first. That in my... That's my ideal situation. Besides, Eric does end up dead in one of those pathways. Although, I believe that's a pathway where Sigma's group lives, isn't it? I think. Yeah, that was, that was the pathway where Sigma's group lives, so this has to be different, but whatever. Eric! Maybe I'd kill myself, but no, I don't want to do that. Fuck that. I'm not supposed to have said no one. <gasps> ah! Oh god! Are you... for real? I'm surprised he didn't fire off in desperation. So how do you feel about that, Mira? <laughs> how do you feel, Eric? This is... a joke, right? I, I just realized that he's probably Kirk Thornton. Because, uh, yeah, I'm putting two and two together. He's the only voice that I feel like I recognize, but I'm not sure from where. And I recognize Kirk Thornton from the credits, so I kind of put him in my mind like, he's probably Kirk Thornton, I think. Oh. Mm. Looks like it got you pretty good. You'd probably come out okay if we moved to help you right now, but... But I don't want you want you because I'm a bitch. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. You seem very calm about a lot of things, but this is one thing that if you were actually lovers, you'd be getting pretty emotional. So yeah, there's something up with you. M Mira? Oh! Eric, I'm going to kill you. I... That's hot. I see. Of course. At this point, it is the more rational decision, honestly. I mean, that's a bit too cold. Like, out of nowhere, yes, I'm gonna kill you. But it is the most rational choice, you know, if your emotions aren't getting in the way. Because he's practically dying at this point. We probably can't save him. So we might as well kill him so we can get out, right, at this point? But still, like, that's if your emotions aren't getting the better of you. I mean, she seems someone who's mostly level and down to earth and calm, but that's a bit too calm. Ooh. You only need one more. Do you have any last words? Mira, I forgive you. You look better when you smile. <sighs> Why? 
I don't know what it is, but I think the bad girls. I always like the bad girls. Like, I don't know. When, when uh, you know, the sexy girls doing the bad things gets my dick a bit rock hard sometimes. Even when I know it shouldn't be. I'm like, down, boy. Down. They're a bad person. You're not supposed to like them. You're asking me that? You're the one who took the first shot. Y yeah. You're right. But... How, how can you be so calm about it? Calm? Oh no, I'm actually surprised right now. Oh, you're showing it, that's for sure. I had no idea his last words would be the same as my firsts. Your firsts? Your... Oh... 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 You really are the serial killer? No. Wouldn't that be too simple? Right? You're first. No, not that way. It's something else. First of all, it's not as if I was actually dating him or anything. Oh. Oh, you mean your first boyfriend when you dumped him? Is that what you mean? Because you kind of threw me for a loop there. That's probably what they mean. Because this real reveals a bit of nowhere, if that's the case. I guess you weren't really in love then. I suppose he thought we were, though. I just let him go since it would have been a hassle. Wow. Again, though. That's, that's so hot. I like it. I like the bad girls. A hassle? What about how Eric feels? His feelings, huh? I haven't really been able to understand emotions my whole life. Wow. Anger, sadness, pain, fear. So that's why she's always been so calm. I get it. And things like love. So when Eric said he liked me as much as he did, I didn't know why. I know why, though I found it weird that you liked him. I don't even really understand what he said before he died. Whoa. What are you doing? I'm going to touch Eric's heart. Ever since I was little, I've always been told I'm callous and unfeeling. Why did the faces on people change? I never understood what expressions were. I'd take a mirror and practice making them every day, but they never quite looked right. One day my mother told me something. Deep inside a person's chest is an object called a heart. This heart controls their emotions and changes their expressions. I remember thinking, that's unfair. Why was everyone hiding this important thing inside so no one else could see? I wanted to see what it looked like. I decided my first would be a woman. About the same No, they are saying she's the serial killer. So I fucking called that shit. But is she the one who killed everybody in that one pathway? I mean, but but no, because how would she access the other wards? Interesting. I feel like this reveals a bit out of nowhere. Uh, it's hot, don't get me wrong, but it feels slightly out of nowhere. Um... Yeah, this is yeah. She's definitely the serial killer. Okay, I thought they were joking and it was about boyfriends, but no, no, she's the killer. Okay, um, so my initial prediction was right. Um, all right. Um, okay. Me, just my mother. I waited on an isolated street so there would be no bystanders. And then I stabbed her without warning with a small knife I brought with me. That actually remind I was yeah, that's what I was gonna bring up. I, I remembered earlier in the game at some point, I think someone said that the killer would remove their heart or something. Um, I don't know if that if they said that exactly, but something like that's in my mind floating around. So if that is the case, that would make sense, because she wanted to touch their heart. She wanted to steal the thing that was sacred to them. Oh. Yeah. I practiced on animals, but I was still surprised by how fast she collapsed. Why did you do this? I want to see what a heart is. 
I think I'm the only one who doesn't know. Oh, she sounds so innocent. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Hey, that's where you hide it, right? I know where it is. Hurry up and show me. <laughs> I forgive you. Really? That's random for that girl to say, whoever that was. I wonder if she's going to be related to anybody else and that's going to come back to bite Mira. Um, whatever the case is, that, uh, yeah, um, that sounds weird, again, for her to say that, for a random girl, but maybe because she doesn't want the, the Mira girl to go crazy, maybe it's because she's a young girl at that point, and so she thought her she could still be saved? Maybe. So please, don't ever do something so, so terrible again. Can you do that? Oh, it's such a shame that the hot boob cleavage girl actually is evil in this one. I called it, but it's a shame. Maybe I can save her with my dick powers. I can convert her to the heart side of the force? Why? Because smiles... The exact same thing. Better wow. Smiles? The woman didn't answer me. Patted at her face for a long time. She didn't even blink anymore. When I gave up on waking her, I thoroughly searched for her heart. It took some time, but I soon felt an unfamiliar, warm, comforting sensation. I knew it! It was here! The last expression the woman formed on her face was a smile. Well, that's when I realized that this kind of moment was when you should smile. Oh. The moment when you're dying is the moment you should smile? I think you got the wrong message from that. Yeah. The woman formed on her face was a smile. Dying with a smile is supposed to be something you want to achieve, but it's not not trying to tell your killer that it's a good thing. Began to hunt for that. Reaching out and touching heart after heart. Because you wanted them to smile and you thought smiling meant killing them would be the best way to get at their happy heart feelings? That's disturbed. I like it. I began to hunt for that. Reaching out and touching heart after heart. I can still save her. I was terrible at it at first. I barely touched hearts and always badly. I feel so bad for you. But after doing it over and over again, I eventually got better at it. Good job. High five. Fear. Hatred. Boop five. Sadness. I learned about so many emotions by touching hearts. Good for you. And there was always new expressions to see. But unfortunately, after that first, I was never able to find that comforting heart. I wanted to feel that warmth one more time. I wandered aimlessly, searching to find someone who held that same warmth. And that was how one day, I came across Eric. So when were you planning on killing him? How long were you planning on he swinging him along? was working at an ice cream shop. With one glance. I could tell he was useless. No talent, no worth, nothing. Ouch! I've seen many hearts of those like him, but none held my interest. Why would they? Naive, helpless weaklings. It's as if they're amusing creatures simply there to be exploited. Yep. That's all I saw them as. But Eric... Something felt different with him. I stopped by the shop several times to watch him. I just had to figure out how he was different from all the others. I tried talking to him. I spent time speaking with him, going places together to learn how he reacts. But I still didn't know. At one point, I thought I'd made a mistake. But... Oh, this... This is it! I'm happy for you? I knew Eric would be different! Hooray? I had a hunch when I first met him, and I was right. Boop five? I told you, didn't I? 
Yeah, his he's shaking. words were exactly the same as my first. Maybe that means it's a bookend and he should be your last victim ever, so don't kill me, please? That would, that, that'd be nice. Oh. How incredible is that? Yeah, he's, he's definitely your high note. You'll never get a better one than his. Might as well not try, right? Right? Oh. I can save her? person really truly loved me so this is love this now announcing the current casualties C team Carlos Junpei Q team Eric D team Diana, five, Sigma. These six are now deceased. Was that Eric's dead face from 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 um, Diana's pathway? It can't be, but it kind of looked the same. Maybe something similar will happen in another pathway. I don't know. <laughs> Look at that jiggling eye. I like it. Usually it's the boobs that jiggle. As a result, six X passes will be revealed. Find, jump. Yup, Eric is poor. That's fitting. That is all. I just noticed. I think that's an anagram. An anagram? Oh, and we're just casually going along with it, huh? <laughs> that's cool. Although, it's probably because we're scared of her and, you know, we don't want to go against her. I mean, hey, you want to do your thing, Mira? You go ahead and do your thing. It's probably the smarter thing to do. Be friends with her. Maybe we can be besties. As long as we don't love each other, we'll be fine, right? You switch the letters around to get a different meaning. What is it? You're slower than five, but what is it? The truth is invisible. The truth is invisible. So we need the goggles from Sigma's Pathway, of course. So that's what it changes to, huh? What do you think it means? Hmm, I'm not really sure. Maybe it's similar to a human heart. <laughs> you can't see it because it's hidden inside your chest. I don't think it's quite the same thing. No, oh, there's Gab. All right, should I put them in? Yeah, go ahead. Wow, so casual about it. I I'm surprised Q is acting that way. That is the smart way to act. But again, you'd think he'd be more terrified, especially as a kid, but uh, I guess he's holding it in. Good on him. This is definitely the smart thing to do, at least until we can potentially get help. And even then, as long as we keep her as a friend, it shouldn't be that bad, right? Right? I mean, we're not her age, right? So there wouldn't be any love? I don't know. Um, all right, let's go check on those passes. Just please don't kill me as we're leaving. That would be me, and that would be a dick move. Or a vagina move in your case. Fight, jump, pour, blue, red, milk. Got milk? I got a milk. I got a sexy mama with me. Even if she's a serial killer. You're okay, my book, because you're hot. What? Lame excuse, but... Uh... I can change her. I can save her with my dick. She just has to experience my dick, then she'll know love. At least Gab comes this time, yay! Okay, let's go. Yeah. So casual. Is Gab coming with too? Alright, happy ending. Sort of. Q gets out? Yeah, credits! Okay. Isn't that a pathway we could have done like right away after the shower room? I think it is. Like, that's a big reveal. Um... And that's a- and yeah, that's just so casual. Is there gonna be an after credit scene, or is that it? Cause wow, like that- yeah, that's a pathway we could've done right after the- Like, right after the initial vote, I'm pretty sure we could've done that. Usually they save those for later. But, uh... I mean, to be fair, that was one of my big complaints about, um, VLR. They kept trying to block off plots you didn't see deals reveal too soon, but then when you finally did see the reveals, they all sucked. And there was multiple different ways to reveal it, and they were all bad. Um, this reveal compared to those... It was alright. It felt a bit sudden. But, um... 
I mean, it was fine. I mean, it wasn't great, but it was hot, and it was sexy while she did it. And I love how casual the whole thing was. So, um, yeah, I mean, it was what it was. We'll see where she goes from there. Is there anything more to her character, or is, like, okay, she's just emotionless and sometimes a serial killer. Is that all there is to her? She's obviously not the big bad guy. That's an interesting way of doing one of the endings, though, because usually, once we find the big bad guy, like, they're secretly responsible for killing everyone, and then you get to the end of the game, and that's when they beat them, and then after they beat them, they have to confront the real Zero. But that's not what happened this time. This time, she just happened to be revealed, doing what she did and killing, and she got away with it. And then they just left and lived. It's kind of, uh, the bad guy wins in that sense. So, it's neat. It's a, it's a different, it's a, it's a divergence. So I wonder what would have happened if I tried to shoot Mira. Probably Eric would have killed me, and if I killed myself, I'd die. So it's probably the best outcome. That's definitely the happy end. Whatever the case, um, yeah. Uh, I like this team a lot. Like, I feel bad for Eric, but, oh, Mira was so, like, she's so sexy when she does it. And I'm like, oh, you're a bad girl, and I, I hate, I like it, but, oh, I shouldn't like it, but, uh... And then there's Q, who's fun. Um, I'll see what more there is to do with their team, because Eric is definitely hiding something, because, like, he killed someone in the past, I think. He's definitely got some hidden secrets of his own, and Q obviously has secrets. Is there anything more to Mira, though? Because I liked Mira. I still like Mira, but, um, you know, you know, she is kind of a little bit crazy, but that's why I'm just curious. Like, because, again, this was a pathway I think you can do right after the first pathway. So, like, is there anything more to her character, is what I'm wondering. I would think so. I would hope so. Again, this isn't the same way they normally reveal bad guys, so maybe there will be a big twist later on. Um, maybe there will be more to her, like in other pathways. I don't know. Maybe. That was neat, though. I saw it coming, but it was neat. I don't think she was the killer in the Diana pathway, though. I think the game wants you. I think the game wants you to think that, but I don't think that's true. Q and one. What is love, baby? Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me no more. So like, there's Q and one, Q and two, D and one, D and two, C and one, C and two, and then there'd be some crazy true ending. Well, crossbow ending. That was fun. We're having fun, right, guys? After credit scene, there's only only one more left in Q's thing. Um, oh, he has a crossbow in that thumbnail. I didn't even notice. Um, there's three other options. I'm wondering what that's all about. But yeah, that, that was that was a fun ending. That was definitely a fun ending. All right, uh, this time let's kill the crazy bitch instead. I'd rather not, because Eric will probably go even crazier than Mira is. Because, but anyways. Mira. No, you won't! Oh! Is it gonna end the same way regardless? Man, always with the yell and with the show arrow, slow arrow launch. So is he gonna get in the way and then Mira's gonna kill him anyways? Oh, hey, you actually have some emotion in your voice this time. Mira. No, not there. Oh, you missed the heart. Is that it? You hit the right side, not the left? If you do it there, then his heart will be gone. Uh, is that your way of hiding the fact that she's the killer? Oh, you hit the heart, right. In the other one, you hit the right side. This time, you hit the left side. But Yeah, that's a weird expression if I hadn't done the other one first. Your heart. I have to. Hey, don't make that face. Smiles look better. Oh, interesting, yeah. interesting, because it's the same kind of thing, but because it hit the heart, she had she's actually having an emotional reaction. That's her first real emotional reaction. That's interesting, and they're kind of hiding what her true intentions are, because. You'd think if you saw this first, you'd be like, oh, of course she wants to save him, and it's hard, of course, that's what keeps him alive, but, oh, it's not for that reason at all, I love it. Now what? 
Ugh, what a waste. <laughs> Again, though, that's super, like, don't down to earth. That's what you say when your lover dies? What a waste. I have to get a new one now. What? See what you went and did? Uh, no. I, I just... I just... And lest we forget, you tried to kill me, didn't you? Hey, you do that all the time. It's not my, it's not, sure, don't blame him. And after all, um, I mean, don't you want to see what your heart is like, right? Better not try to weasel out of this. <sighs> oh, jeez. And just killed the kid just like that? I'm glad I did Eric first because that one, it had, it was a bit too hinty. Like at that point, you, I probably would have been like, oh yeah, probably she's like, probably. I don't know. Eh, maybe not. The way she was talking, it's hard to say. Still though, I, I, I don't regret picking Eric first. Fuck Eric. Uh. C T. Carlos. Oh, showdown. Akane versus, uh, the boobs. The more annoying character versus really probably the one who's worse. But the one I like way better. Jeez. This couldn't have ended any shittier. Mira. You didn't- wait, you didn't- oh. It said Q's name, but it seems like he's still alive. I thought for a second you spared him. Still so calm about the whole time, and she still gets away. A bad guy wins again, but this time it's a game over. Whereas the other time, I just get to leave with the tits, and she gets to have a happy ending. Aw, I'm glad at least she gets a happy ending in the other pathway. I feel for you, Mira. <laughs> oh man, I like her. All right, let's just keep seeing what other options there are. That's two down, two to go, apparently. How are there two to go? Can I say no one? Is that an option? Well, first I'll go with the obvious choice and pick myself, I guess. Q! What happens? Please input Q's name. Oh! Oh! That's interesting! I don't know Q's name! Um, so I guess that leads to an alternative thing that maybe leads to a real ending? Can I say no one? Is there a space button? Yeah. No one. Is that possible? Yeah! No one! But Mira is the one that- Killing Eric is the leads to the ending. That's funny. Ah, fuck you, Eric. This probably won't end well either, though. Um, alright. I'll just slowly put my weapon down first. So now, you two? Yeah, okay. Sure. Oh. <laughs> don't you, don't you dare. No, what are you fucking stupid? Fuck you, Eric. I'm glad you died. No. Fuck you, Eric! I'm glad you died. I made the right choice first. That would blow us all up. Maybe not. <laughs> what an idiot. Now announcing the current casualties. CT. Carlos. Junpei. So to keep up the act, what's Mira gonna say about that? Because she can't just be super nonchalant. I mean, that was a pretty big dick move. Q -T -Q. D -T Diana. Five. Fuck you, Eric. These six are now deceased. As a result, six X passes will be revealed. Now oh, we don't get to see what Mira's thoughts are. Wow. Fuck you, Eric. I know I just saw a serial killer uh, doing her thing, 
But uh, that wasn't nearly as bad as what Eric just did. Because he's not supposed to be a killer. Oh, fuck that. Let's go, Mira. She's playing you. Let's get out of here and build a happy home and wonderful future together. I hope she kills you as soon as you get out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hate hate Eric now. Just as I said, I was starting to maybe like him a bit more. Oh, jeez! You haven't seen this before. Man, I don't think I could be any happier. I have you, Mira. Man, this bed is super comfy. Ah, I couldn't ask for anything more. Isn't that right? Yeah, right. Uh, I hope we can be like this every day. <sighs> Forever and ever and... She killed him, right? She was sick of his shit? Oh, beautiful! I'm actually really glad we got that extra bit. I joked about how I hope you die just afterwards. And he did! Yes! Mira taking one for the team. Uh, I have it so reversed. I should probably think of her as worse than, than, than him. But no, I don't. You know why? Because that's an actual psychological problem. She's a little fucked up in the head. And she could potentially get help, maybe. Eric, though, he maybe can get help too. But it's worse because... He actually thinks he's sort of maybe in the right, whereas Mira thinks she's in the right, but for a different reason. It's more, less that she thinks she's in the right, more that she doesn't care, whereas Eric is like, oh, I just need Mira so I can kill you and we can get out now, let's go. It's because he was personally invested. So, in, in I don't know. The point is, I don't know, maybe it's just that Mira's hot and, and I fucking hate Eric, but I don't know. If, yeah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you for killing him. Oh, that was that. At least that we got that little extra bit at the end there. Okay. I was actually starting to like Eric a little bit in that previous ending, but no. Fuck him now. He's officially my least favorite again. Fake Kane is not looking so bad anymore. We're gonna have to figure out Q's name apparently before we can get find out what this is. But yeah, thanks, game. What is Q's real name? Um, I'll be back to that eventually. This is probably where I should end it. Um. I mean, I could maybe keep going for a little bit, but, um, I don't know what I'd do. Yeah, so I think I'll just end it here. I'll see you guys next time on Let's Play Zero Time Dilemma Blind. Um, I think next time, uh, I guess I'll do some more Carlos stuff, because we've done two puzzles with, uh, Mira's group and with, um, Diana's group, but we only have done one so far with this guy's group, I believe. So, yeah. See you guys next time. Bye.